Purple gang gang, Purple baby. Gang. Purple gang gang. Oh, hey, didn't see you there. Happy Saturday. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, my goodness. Are you lighting up like Christmas in March? Is, is it, it March? March? April? It's almost April. June? July? Whatever time it is, it's party time. It is party Purple gang time. gang time. Purple gang gang party time. Yes, indeed. Let's see some purple hearts in the comments and uh, welcome. Light it up. Welcome to our 12th episode. You know, a lot of people said uh, we'd never do one episode, but here we are on number 12. So shout out to all you haters. We love you and we support you. Ourselves included. We were actually quite surprised that we made it to two, let alone 12. Yeah, let alone one, right? Right. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, good times. But how about those sponsors? How about them? Wolf King Customs. Oh. Ooh. You know, oh, they've got a... Uh, you know, if you missed it last week and the week before, they had a great sale going on. It's no longer live right now. But uh, if you check out Vans Permaheart today, we've got this wonderful Wolf King custom sticker over here. And what's that on the other uh, breast assist? Is that a purple gang gang sticker? Oh my, is it? I think we were surprised with that one. And Lynn Weren't just, we? uh, Lynn just, it He's showed up in one of our Wolf King custom packages. Us. He really does. He's a wonderful human being. And speaking of Lynn, a uh, big shout out to our homie, William Golden for helping us find one of Lynn's most favorite toys that we were happy to send him last weekend. So big shout out, William. You're a great dude. We appreciate you. You're the real MVP. But uh, speaking of Wolfkin Customs, since you missed the sale, there's still a lot of great sculpts available on there right now. They have the super awesome blip, bloop, Blorka uh, space orc head sculpt. And uh, one of our great friends actually uh, painted one of these up this week. You may have seen it. I'm sure you have. You know, if you trust your algorithm, then you've definitely seen it. But shout out to uh, Arts by Ackerman, Curtis, the man behind the scenes here with a super awesome space orc. It's beautiful. I want at least four or five of them. Curtis, if you're watching, let us know in the comments if we can uh, commission you for some of these dope space orcs. If you have an extra three days to paint it for us, of course. But yeah. bum, 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 bum. I believe that's a Wolf King custom sculpt that I'm looking at right there. It was once a... Uh... A well, lilac colored skull, but oh, he ate it. Sorry. Yeah. Trying to get Jordan to showcase his art. He it's won't do it. It's not done yet. Yeah. Stop judging me. It looks good. No but, judgments. Uh, you know, big, super huge shout out. And uh, speaking of some other sponsors, uh, we got the Toy Forge. Tink, toy Forge. We're tink, talking about the Toy Forge. Tink. Tink. Uh, you may have heard us last week, but uh, the Toy Forge is actually going to have a very huge April uh, sales drop with a bunch of new sculpts. They've kind of teased a few of them already. Hippity hop, 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 y'all. Some of the ones you might have seen, we got this wonderful Dryad kit on the left here. Super badass in every single way. And if you've been following Toy Forge for a while, uh, I think we saw a super dope like steampunk yes. uh, air balloon dwarf in the past couple weeks. And before that, the balloon is here. Oh, that is a balloon. That's a great balloon. A balloon. And uh, so on the right here, we got a diver kit for dwarves. Uh, Curtis loves dwarves and he loves dwarf fans. So let's go uh, diving. Shout out hashtag dwarf fans. Um, but you know what? Something that hasn't been teased yet. Something that hasn't been shown yet. I think tomorrow is a pretty special day. It's like a holiday. Yeah. It's a holiday. Zombie Jesus Day. Zombie he is Jesus risen. Day. Yes. So. Big shout out Toy Forge. We've got a uh, big shout out Funhouse Customs. We have a very special sculpt that we're going to reveal tonight. And if you like Easter, you might want to grab this uh, new super scary evil bunny head sculpt available in Toy Forge when they drop their big April sale. It's not something you want to miss. I need at least two of them so that way I can do a purple bunny and a traditional bunny. Both of them covered in blood. Shout out Blood for the Blood Gods. Absolutely. Absolutely wonderful. One of our favorite things to apply to uh, our sculpts, our eyebrows. I mean, just pretty much yeah, anything. We, at this we point. wear it to work. You know, we wear it to Costco. Welcome to Costco. We love you. And uh, one quick little uh, shout out here. Uh, you may have heard it here. You may have heard it on Facebook. You may have heard it on Instagram. But our good buddy Dirt, Dirt. he's got a custom contest going on, and it's running through the end of March, which I believe is tomorrow. But uh, Dirk most recently told me that maybe we'll he'll extend it out till Monday. So you have that until Monday trickster. to go ahead and get your entries in. Uh, four different categories, beginner custom, advanced custom, uh, mythic photography, and mythic artwork. So drop Dirk's uh, hashtag 
Dirk's custom contest on Facebook, Instagram. We'll probably probably be reviewing every last one of these entries eh, sometime in April. So definitely tune in to see uh, see your artwork and see some of these entries, and maybe we'll discuss who wins. Maybe not. Who knows? Dirk Gotta knows. Tune in to find out. Dirk knows. He does know. Speaking of Dirk, that amazing human being that he is sent us like a box of magnificence that uh, – Arrived at the house. Um, Rosie wanted to get deep into it. Logan has been, you know, chomping at the bit trying to get into it. We just got like shout a, out Dirk. We got a gang of Japanese snacks here, and uh, not gonna lie, Jordan and I did get into some delightful cookies last night. They were bourbon. They said bourbon on them. We ate the entire package. Did not taste like bourbon, but they did taste delicious, like they Duncan did. Hines soft chewy cookies. Yeah, what, yeah, that's exactly but like bite size. They're yeah, they're really good. Yeah, eat the whole package in a matter of moments. But we've got a lot of great different candies in here. Uh, we don't really speak languages that aren't American. USA, can I get a USA slow chant in the comments? USA, Billy, start that USA slow chant. Um, but yeah, lots of great stuff that we can't read, but. You know, we see different. Uh, I think everything here tastes like crab legs, which sounds we're cool. trusting it's not poisonous. We love crab legs, uh, sweets and chocolate. If we and... die while we're snacking tonight, give Dirk a shout out. This one has pictures of turtles and lobsters on it, so it's like a turtle lobster. Like, there you go, you see him down there. Looks delicious. I love eating turtles and lobsters and lobsters. This oh. I can read that. That does say rum raisins. Yeah, they had me at rum. But I'll stay for the raisins. We got some dope little kaiju in here. Shout out to Godzilla and King Kong teaming up in theaters right now. We got a beverage that's uh, Chill Sing Cider. It's a lemon lime soda. It's like the Japanese Sprite. Shout out Japanese Sprite. This is what I want to talk about because he did say the green ball was for me. So I want to be sure and dig into that at some point. Yeah, absolutely. But huge shout out, Dirk. Uh, can't we wait appreciate to see these snacks. Uh, Maybe when our guest comes on later, maybe he'll uh, want some snacks. Maybe we'll want some snacks. Maybe we'll chew extremely loudly into the mic. Absolutely. We'll and, pork uh, in time. Until the, the viewers go down to zero, because that's what we're here for. Yeah. Eat snacks. Snacks. So big shout out, bro. We love you. Thank you very much. Um, You know what? What doesn't – you mentioned he's got the another contest. You talked about Dirk's contest, but uh, – Oh my goodness gracious! We don't. Somebody really, else doing a contest? We don't really know what's happening with that right now. But uh, one of our great friends and one of our actually several of our great friends. Uh, shout out to the Legions Lounge, Trevor, Nate, and Bill. You guys are absolutely awesome. You host the most amazing contest every single year. It's the uh, Pop and Swap All Stars. Everybody gets out of their comfort zone. The creativity really starts to flow. Uh, we started a. Uh, it started out as a as a simple wholehearted troll in uh, Legion's Lounge last week about maybe a purple pop and swap category. It may manifest, it may not, but we really want it to happen. So we're excited either way. You know, once those rules come out, maybe uh, we'll hear some more information this upcoming Monday. Maybe we'll hear it sometime this week. But uh, definitely uh, check that out once it goes live. I'm sure there'll be a lot of great purple prizes. Speaking maybe. of uh, going back to, if I may, uh, no. No, I, I'm I'm going to go go ahead. Do Trevor, uh, can't do this. Eh, we we kind of need to. Do it. He he uh, he was speaking about the purple gang gang and about Popeye, who, you know, after uh, after after some concern was was brought to my attention from from people near and dear to my heart. We we've, we've done our best to make sure that Popeye is permanently suppressed, but Trevor wanted to bring him out anyways, and then he immediately felt bad uh, and and thought that. Perhaps some people might have been listening and might have been paying attention. We were, in fact, paying attention, Trevor. Purple so, uh, drone drones. We yes, have them in every single mythic there. live they're chat listening. list. We've got purple drones actually staged outside of each and every one of your houses. So we know your next move. Whether you support us or not, we support you. And we love you. Yeah. We love everybody. Purple loves you. Yeah. So, so what, um, what did we make for? Let's, for, let's see what happened with Trevor? all that. See what happened. Hey, uh, roll that beautiful bean footage. Roll it. Like that. And there's um, Nate doing his Van Johnson oh, impression right I? there. <laughs> I think that's what I was doing. Hey, 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 hey. 
开开开开开，开开开开开，开开开开开，开开开开开，开开开开开，开开开开开，开开开开开，开开开开开，开开开开开，开开开开开，开开开开开，开开开开开，开开开开开开，开开开开开开，开开开开开，开开开开开，开开开开开，开开开开开，开开开开开，开开开开开，开开开开开，开开开开开，开开开开开。开开开开开，开开开开开，开开开开开，开开开开开，开开开开开，开开开开开，开开开开开。Oh my goodness, what just happened? Did was that Popeye meets Popeye meets Popeye meets Popeye? Who's that behind us? Where'd you come from? Never sneak up on a man who's been in the chemical fire accident. Shout out, Fred Stoddard. Welcome our guest, the myth, the legend. We have had the distinct pleasure of learning about photography today from none other than Brett Stoddard. And we've had the opportunity to talk about Brett Stoddard's photography with none other than Brett Stoddard. So it's, it's it just so wonderful. It's been a, a, an amazing day for us. Hi, Rosie. Hey, Rosie. Yeah. She she hasn't left Brett's side since. No, nope. she since loves her. Here, Come on. It's you okay. Know. You can say hello. Hey, look you who it is. Sweet girl. We love you. Rosie says there's Steph in the comments. Yeah. I like to talk to Steph. She always asks Yeah, me. she's looking for Steph. That's what it is. She Shout out Steph Aleph. Absolutely. You did awesome on uh, hey, Legion's Mama. Ladies the other this night, ranking girl. those uh, I know, my shirt's Legion's horrible. Ladies. Yeah. So shout out to the Legion's Ladies, too. Wonderful show all around. Legion's Ladies. Woo! Shout out Brett Stoddard. Oh, my goodness. What you got going on over there? So where where did you come from? What what brought you here today? A you, car. Yeah, no, you, you've been here, there, and everywhere. This has been a busy week yeah, for you. I've uh, been towing for work uh, down in South Carolina. Coming back through, figured I'd uh, take an extra day and stop by and see my two favorite purple people. You made us excited. That's so wonderful. Yeah. We he, love you, buddy. He inspired us to clean, <laughs> and that's not something we do often. We've been talking about it all year. Yeah, and, uh, we yeah, literally have, yesterday. actually, yeah. yeah. And now we've got so much room. Like up here in the Purple Gang Gang headquarters, like we're thinking about getting bunk beds. It's going to be pretty awesome. There's Absolutely. room for activities and other cool stuff. Like we've got nunchucks and we can spin them around and do like full like kicks and stuff. Jordan did a back handspring right before yeah. we went live. It's pretty amazing. We've been cartwheeling since yesterday. I yeah. hear Twister might be in our future. Absolutely. I think it could be. Sounds like it's going to be a fun evening tonight. Oh my goodness. Ooga. Ooga. Holy crap. Oh, what's going on? Oh, I managed to get the green ball open. Uh, Dirk, if you're in here or not, it looks like this is – he almost looks like a muscle man, if you remember those figures from back in the day, but he has articulation. I'm probably going to put him together tomorrow. But, oh, he definitely has articulation. It's freaking cool, dude. Yeah. Oh, wow, he works out. He, he does. Muscles. He definitely looks like a muscle man. I'll probably – yeah, I'll paint him up. You is know what color like a, I'm going to paint him, right? Is that like a Bandai Glyos muscle man? He kind of looks like a Glyos. He really does. Should he looks like a Glyos. It all purple, then like bust it out with a symbol. Yeah, that's exactly the way to do it. There's okay. no other way. You heard it here first. We're going to paint him purple, Dirk. He Maybe. is a giant muscle man. That's, thank you. That's exactly what I thought he was, Dirk. We Sweet. Could, we could probably glue him to a mythic shoulder and turn him into a Dirk's custom contest entry for a Ooh. beginner customizer. There we go. That, 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 that accurately describes what I am. <laughs> You know, and maybe we'll do an intermediate and advanced category too. There's no intermediate. Not if I'm involved. But that's what I'm entering. Yeah. Well, yeah. You know, you got it like that. I'm not bad, bad, but I'm not good. So I'm like lower bottom tier, but I enjoy it. And that's what matters. I have fun. I'm that that mid to actually, let's be honest, I'm lower. I'm I'm sub basement. If if we're talking cast society, I'm. Uh, I'm, I'm untouchable. I'm, you know, that's yeah. Like that in my if I'm driving, you get out of my way. Mm. I'll hit you with a stick. But um, you know, did anybody else get in on that D13 Biblical Adventures uh in stock sale today? Which I hope we don't steal my Jesus. That old man stole my Jesus. Oh, <laughs> that's how we felt. We were ready to check out within seconds, oh. and uh, you know, click pay right and just. Dot, 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 gray box, dot, 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 dot. I just wanted that chocolate three pack. Congrats to those who got them. Not upset. I mean, Not at all. Thank you for supporting Chris. He's a phenomenal guy. D13, they're doing great things. Awesome so, human being. Awesome toy line. Can't wait for everything to hit the, the mainstream. And uh, Chris, you're doing the Lord's work. 
you're doing the purple Lord's work. Uh, we still want to see a translucent purple Jesus. Purple Jesus. Purple Jesus, Jesus. Absolutely. But uh, wonderful sale all around. You had the opportunity to buy some of those con exclusives uh, that sold out extremely fast, such limited quantities. These are definitely going to be uh, collector grails in the next few years once D13 takes <sighs> off. Jordan, you really need to be talking them down. They're they're great, y'all. I'm but, not going to uh, talk It's my these understanding down. that if if you went outside with them and 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 natural air touches them, they disintegrate and and go back to the Lord and Savior. So if it's you recycling. Have them, go ahead and send them our way because we'll make sure that they're properly taken care of and they they don't just uh, disintegrate into the air and go to the Lord and Savior. You know, there's been six reports of that so far already. The, uh, uh, the biblical it's adventures. It's like the rapture, but with toys. Yeah, yeah. Go on up, buddies. Yep. It's your, your time. Deserve. You're chosen. We believe in you. So, yeah, big shout out D13. Big shout out Chris. We absolutely love what you're doing. And, uh, you know, if you've got any of those uh, Chocolate Angel three packs, you know, slide into those uh, purple DMs. Buddy. What's up? Yeah. But, anyways, uh, what else we got going on tonight? A lot of like, things. Like what? Things what do you have going on? I don't know. Stuff. It's never tell me your next move. Oh, my goodness. Never tell me your next move. I don't tell oh, my next gracious. move. What does that even mean? I don't even know anymore. Um. Yeah. So, uh, Alexa, play uh, Gorgo Bordello. Gogo Bordello, start wearing purple. Hey, Google, play Gogo Bordello, start wearing purple. Hey, Siri, play Gogo Bordello, start wearing purple. Does that actually work? Uh, it sometimes, sometimes it does. does. Yeah. If, uh, any of your, the comments. Uh, if any of your spy devices just started playing Gogo Bordello, start wearing purple, let us know in the comments. And speaking of never letting them know your next move, Speaking of D13. just happened there time Lots for a giveaway for billy time for yeah. a giveaway billy's still alive and billy we are so glad you didn't die two weeks ago because we love you you were absolutely wonderful to hang out with at toy lane and what you got over there man yeah. um a first order stormtrooper i need i need pages in here to tell me exactly what i got in my hand because as we know i'm i'm star wars ignorant but it's from my house to your house um hey hashtag amber for a day if yeah. you would like this stormtrooper to come to your house and shoot at everything and hit nothing. Ha! Huh. Hey, Peter, Star Wars joke, man. I nailed it. They don't hit shit when they fire, do they? I don't know. I've never seen it. And Brett, can I get a rolling? Are, are they marksmen? Hell no. Yep. See? I knew what I was talking about. But, yeah, Amber for a day and uh, stormtroopers coming your way. Ha, 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 ha.
Dad and, jokes. Uh, you know, check out uh, our description for this video. Uh, free shipping within the continental U.S. Go ahead and message us on Facebook, the official Please. Purple Gang Gang, with proof of subscription. And uh, that's that yeah, easy. Yeah, you, you got to subscribe to the YouTube channel. And, and by all means, like. Like the live stream or and die trying. Yes, you can do it. I believe in you. Absolutely. I believe in you. you got it in you. We do believe in you. Yep. Each and every one of you. We appreciate you for of showing the, up. Of the uh, 3,272 people in here, you know, I only see uh, 2,200 entries. So yeah, that's a really so good shot of winning. That's way better than the Powerball. Yeah, and, and hit those likes. Yeah. Make it happen. Hit those likes. Otherwise, our homie uh, Big Greg will kick in your door. And uh, click that like button for and you. And the rats in my attic will eat my toenails tonight. And I'm partial to my toenails. I had them freshly painted. And I'd like to keep them looking pretty for Easter. We've got people coming over. And they're expecting to see uh, beautifully painted toenails. And I don't want the rats to eat them. Do you want the rats to eat them? Hey, I don't want the rats to eat them. Thank I took you. a I great that. photo. You had posed like this big uh, savage he-man with a rat. Did last I? Night. <laughs> did you take that picture? I did take. I didn't put it in the slideshow, but it's hilarious. I died. You saw what I did there, yeah? Oh yeah, no, no. no I, I know I, you I, left it I, for I, me. I, yeah, no, I did. I'm quite aware of what was happening. You thought I, you know, this is the first time I brought it up, and it's been like a full 24 hour period. I know what I did, but yeah. Oh yeah. And so, if my brother was watching, he would understand. It was. It was like the time we had those skeletons and left them out on the uh, island and surprised each other each day to see what had happened. Have you? Yeah. <laughs> that was the picture. When I came that up this morning to grab my stuff, this is, <laughs> you, this, you is how, this is how. No, as soon as I saw that, I'm like, "Yo, Vin left me like a little <laughs> treat. Like the yeah. Easter Bunny come on Friday night. Hey, buddy, you're too early. I mean, uh, you have my consent to post that. If you can add that to the slideshow, I mean, take your time. I'll I'll talk to the folks that are in here. Hey, you all know I what? ask is, uh, uh, there we go. Oh, let's go ahead and start. I mean, okay. Yeah. All right. Fine. Don't judge me. I, yeah, I am immature. Off. I mean, I'm immature. You know I'm immature. If you've met me, you know I got some screws that are loose, but it was a rat it's and it a was a savage Jesus. It's a skeleton rat Michaels with a savage He-Man uh, performing phylogious act. No, that's not what happened. They were, they, were, they were wrestling and they were having a tickle fight. And who are you to judge love? That's what I'm saying. Why did you take his loincloth off first if they're just wrestling? It, it had nothing new in me. It was the uh, – I was watching – last night I was watching uh, The Princess Bride, and I remember – The rodents going of the, unusual – yeah, Exactly. The rodents of uh, – Unusual size. Unusual yeah. size, and, and there was Savage He-Man, and there was these – you know, this rodent. bony rodent, and I, I couldn't help but notice that he, he was of somewhat an unusual size, and, and it was – yeah, yeah, you know. that checks yeah. out. Yeah, that checks out, you know. But, um, yeah, hit that hashtag. I'm glad, you, I'm glad you saw that after the fact. Like, I spent like legit time to all those that, that know me as vanilla. I, I actually did some posing, so yeah, yeah, everything's articulate on Savage E Man. It was, isn't uh, is doing something with oh, like a Savage E Man, yeah, like custom contest. I think I saw that. But he never reaches out to us for us mm. to like plug anything. So I don't know the exact details. I just know my dude is the Wiz one. Like did is doing like a super dope like contest. He does with great things. He man. He does. He's mm. absolutely inspirational in every single way. And uh we love you, Wiz. And if you need any legal advice on the West Coast, that's the man you want to talk to. That's your dude. You know. And if you need any legal advice on the East Coast. Bam, 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 bam. Shout out to our dude Head Chow. Uh, who who was in the uh, the Saturday Day Live return earlier? Not only did Head Chow return with Rygon, but late night LeBron was back. Tell me that wasn't You've magical. Missed, bro. Drop we some love purple you. hearts for our homies at yeah. Saturday Day Live. We love you guys in every single way. So you know, keep doing it. We're here. For we you. will never forget the initial leg up that they gave us. You know, or the the purple imposters rather, which they uh, Curtis. Well, no, they they gave it to us, but we got, we hacked. got hacked. I mean, we, yeah, yeah, we, yeah, we hadn't, you know, upgraded our McAfee or whatever. Our firewall I'm was not existing. I don't understand at that these point. things that uh, are known as technology, but yeah, you know, um, they hacked our dial up. We we're on fifty six k. You know, shout out AOL. We had um, these nice people at America Online send us these like seven day free trial CDs. Hmm, um, I remember those and that was, you know, it's 2024 and that's how we started our show. We're like, Oh, what are all these streaming people doing? Uh, like, they just do their and thing. then the AOL disc came in. It's like, we manifested our future. So big shout out AOL. You're a real one. Yeah. 
Yeah. So uh, let's go ahead and uh, do a little spinny spin here for this uh, first giveaway. How does that sound? Sounds good, said Brett's daughter. Oh, hey. Thanks, Brett. Let's spin it. Ba, 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 ba. Are you, are you here? Hmm? Yeah, no. Show what you want to say. Just activate your purple brain brain. We don't care. Oh, I saw theory. Just a nerdy it. dad. Um, Congratulations. We're going to send your prize back to Pennsylvania with uh, Brett and, uh, you know, just reach out to him and uh, maybe you guys can have lunch. <laughs> <laughs> just kidding. You know the rules. Check the description, Jason. We love you, brother. Uh, we've got this fancy Star Wars dude who can't fire a uh, blaster rifle to save his he life. Fire it, he just won't hit shit. With your name on it. There it is. So, big sure. shout out to our dude, Jason. Just a nerdy dad. You're an awesome dude. We got to meet you at ZoloCon. So, you Good know. Dude. Yeah, love you, bro. Wholeheartedly, dude does some uh, sweet photography, and uh, he's, he's good peoples. You know who else does sweet photography? Uh, who? Brett Stoddard. You know, not enough people talk about Brett Stoddard's photography. And that's true. That is so true. Brett, what's up, buddy? Just a simple guy making my way through the universe. I heard you just click buttons. I'm a button pusher. Nice. By chance, could you uh, reach behind you and tell us what's going on here, Brett? Abandoned orphanage at the town of Pripyat outside the Chernobyl nuclear power plant that in April of 1986 decided to melt down. Are we pointing fingers at who to blame? Themselves. Did anyone get canceled on Twitter in the 1986 uh, Chernobyl meltdown? Let I us know in the so. comments. <laughs> but this was the orphanage, and there's a bunch of little cribs there and dolls and gas masks. Just a very creepy, eerie image that uh, spoke to me when I was making it. That is accurate. It is beautiful. It is absolutely beautiful. You've got babies on these beds. You've got little baby pro mask on the beds. You've got chunks of, like, I don't know what's melting underneath those beds. I don't know, but what is that, Brett? Uh, when it's like red starts breaking down, the lime tends to start leaching out and mixing with water, kind of like uh, how stalactites and stalagmites form in natural caves. Yeah, no, no, I feel that. But what's the red stuff underneath the rusted bed? Oh, that I don't know. Do we have a science teacher in the comments to explain this to Maybe us? Some form of blanket or fabric. Yeah. That's going to haunt me for the rest of my life. Hey, 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 Dr. Brent, that's wholesome. That is absolutely wholesome. Like your touch buddy. Tis true. There's another one back there. There is another one back there. And while, uh, oh my goodness. In the basement of a middle school in the same town of Pripyat. You may have seen this photo on episode something of Purple Gang Gang Live, but this uh, photo right here absolutely speaks to me. It is wonderful in every single way. and uh, Absolutely littered with gas masks. And not just gas masks, but children's gas masks. Jeez. So, very... So they have been again. utilized. And uh, well, the Soviets taught their populace that the evil aggressor Americans were going to gas them. Mm. So everybody was issued a gas mask. And they mm. knew how to use it. How useful were those during the meltdown of Chernobyl, out of curiosity? Uh, zero. Oh. Yes. Mm. Yes. So uh, don't pay attention to your government and, uh, yes. you know. As a matter of fact, uh, we, we all just registered. Hmm. Can I call a Code Lavender and get a Curtis Ackerman? Hmm? Mm. Curtis. Hmm? Mm. Yeah, exactly. Hey, yeah, buddy. Thank you. Perfect. <laughs> that was wonderful. You heard it here first. Hmm. Curtis. Hmm. 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 Oh my goodness. But yeah, we actually, uh, I took some photos of the photos that Brett Sauter took. Uh, these are my photos that I took. Of They're Brett not Sauter's yours. Photography. Yeah. Look at me. I am the captain now. Yeah. You're, you're the photographer now. <laughs> I am the captain now. No, but, but seriously, like we're going to get these hanged up here in the studio. Hopefully we can get one of them. Uh, Ace out. You know, uh, maybe oh, in a uh, backdrop right view. We can like turn like the camera a little bit so I that mean, way oh, you can enjoy this well. from the ceiling. I mean, what do you want? That would be cool. We could the stuff them that's behind us, us are, are toy giveaways that are coming to our folks as, as we continue to uh, hit the subscriber goals. That is correct. Uh, usually we use a green screen behind us, but we cleared up so much room in here. You know, we went ahead and just 
got some shelves put up it's and like mezco started stacking toys Mayfax, storm collectibles and these are uh, toys that we're giving away to all you the cosmo just for tuning in and you know is having that a purple fun with us. um it's not it's not it's an empty box is that the it's tank teams. team from the uh what's the name of that uh has lab that we're going to give away if we it's, exceed a thousand a, oh a his is that tank? his tank is that our a, team i think it is we but, got some Funhouse Customs. We got some Almeida uh, handmade goodness. Tables. We got Cara some Toy Dune. Forge back here. I see some NECA Ninja Turtle movie figures. But wait, there's more. There's there's so much more. Y'all have no idea what, what we've you know, got in store for us. And we are extremely close to hitting our uh, 500 subscriber giveaway. Uh, so, you know, tell your friends. Tell your grandma. Tell your friends at school. Tell your friends at work. Um, kick in your neighbor's door. Take the phone out of their pocket, pull up YouTube, search Purple Gang Gang, subscribe to our channel on their phone, and if they give you any guff, is guff a appropriate word? Yeah, guff any work. guff at all, you tell them shooting the shelf sent you. That seems like a shooting the shelf move. It really is. Yeah. And, you know, speaking of Brett Stoddard's photography, we actually have one more photo. Uh, we actually uh, got to see him do this live, and the way he orchestrated this photo, it felt like Mickey Mouse in Fantasia. <laughs> The brooms and the vacuums up here and the little candlelight started dancing around and moving the lighting around yeah. for them. It's like, where did that music come from? I don't know. But it, 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 yeah. Have, oh, them have some snacks, uh, my dude. Japan snacks. Um, here we Hope go. you're not allergic. Uh, we were playing with our homie Chuck Swearingen's uh, super dope purple uh, dragon breath breath spell effect that he made by hand. And if you didn't know, Charles is actually going to be at Legion's Con yes. with more super dope purple uh, effects and other great things. Like, he's our dude. We love him. But this is a photo that Brett took with the help of 32 brooms, four mops, uh, a van, and a Jordan to get this a grill lighter. just right. You know, a grill lighter yeah. and uh, two candles. So, big shout out, Brett. This is beautiful. Uh, you need to go ahead and post this in the Cabal. Drop that Dirk's Custom Contest. A hashtag on there and uh collect dope prizes because my first picture of a toy it's right. his first picture of a toy you saw it here first on pgg live absolutely don't forget that so wonderful photo wonderful spell effect super dope dragon shout out four horsemen studios you're awesome we love you yeah, and speaking of things that are awesome the amber for a day lottery yeah, and Curtis, you know, he said some things uh, on the last episode of Saturday Day Live about how, one, you know, Amber for a day, she'll say 12 words. And then Jonathan Hedgehog accurately pointed out that's only if she doesn't like you. Amber won't stop talking around us, and we're the same way around her because we love Amber. We love Ryan. They're awesome people wholeheartedly. She had a lot to say on the Purple Gang Gang. She did. Yeah, she did, especially during the van uh, intervention. Oh. Oh, she said so many great words. Like she's like a professional heart. Hollywood actor. He hasn't drank since. Amber, mm -hmm. you're inspiring. Definitely you know, two of my favorite. This glass is empty. Out with in the morning lines before con. Really is great company all around. Good she's hell. just wonderful Absolutely. people. Wonderful people. Shout out to the Legions ladies, Tanya and Amber. You're some of our favorite people, and we just love everything you guys do. It was an absolute pleasure getting to hang out with Tanya at Toy Toylana. She did some absolutely wonderful lives from the event. She did some awesome interviews with some absolutely wonderful people. Shout out Jeremy Gerard, Mythic Customs. I think I saw a Simple Tricks and Nonsense interview. There was a Scott Warren at Silver Studios interview. It was just great stuff. So, Tanya, keep doing what you're doing. Kevin, super great to finally meet you and see you. You're a wonderful human being. And uh, since we didn't actually get to go to, uh, you know, Toy Con, you know, we kind of split the Purple Gang Gang up a little bit. Um, our homie Brett and G and uh, Schmergen Wergenberger, they actually went ahead and handled the, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, the Toy Con for us and had some good times. Uh, tell us about your, your Toy Con adventures, Brett. Please. Very wet on Saturday. But Cornboy was there. Return of the King. Return yes. of the King. Gondor Glad needs you, Cornboy. That. Let's drop some uh, corn emojis in the chat if you love corn boy. I know I do. Right, right, right. So it was really good seeing him, getting him to sign my skate deck, hang out with my Fellowship of the Lion friends, shoot the shit. Fellowship of the Lion. Lots of shooting of the shit. I don't need you, Brett. And uh, yeah, 
So we have our own little mythic meetups before the shows. And they're through the shows. Go grab a bite. Some people head back to the shows. Do it all again another day. What kind of food do you guys eat at ToyCon? Yo, good old Jersey Diner. Jersey Diner. Some Taylor ham. Pork rolls? Pork roll. If you're from the south. Pork. Taylor ham if you're in the north. Oh, are those the same things? I those was just... are the same things. I've yeah. never heard of either of them. <laughs> Big money, no whammy. You know, I couldn't help but notice that uh, as I'm looking in these comments here, I, I'm seeing a lot of corn, but I'm also seeing a lot of Will White. And Who? You, Who? Know, you, you know Billy Beige. Oh, Billy you Beige. Billy Beige. How, how is old Billy doing? You know, he has risen. <laughs> Billy, had thank risen. you for not dying, Billy. Thank, thank you, so you. Much for thank not you. Dying. With, I, I truly mean that. There right. would not be an episode twelve if Billy had died. If Billy had died two weeks ago, we would not have had such an amazing weekend with him last right? weekend in Atlanta. Billy, you're absolutely wonderful, and thank I you. guess uh, this is what you've got to say for us this week. Lots and prayers for Billy worked. Yep. Oh, we lifted him up, Billy. Hey, Purple Gang Gang. Toy Lanta was a raving success. The barbecue was off the hook. And in particular, one patron, a Mr. Jim Preziosi, had where he loved the raccoon haggis southern style. That was until the, the health department of Atlanta came in and shut me down. So I packed up the camper and I headed back to Mississippi to start a new business venture. I took all the skins and the feathers and the entrails and the outtrails and all the leftovers from the barbecue business, and I had an idea. It's about to be summer, and what's more fun in summer than summer wear? And what do you wear during the summer? Why, you wear your cut-off jeans and cargos. So say hello to Billy Beige's Carcass Cargos this summer. 2024. Thanks for watching. Orders start soon. Billy Beige out. Dr. Brent, 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 Dr. Brent. Billy was really filling out those shorts. I'll just say those boots were made for walking and that's what, just what Billy did. Billy, do you work out? If you're watching, let us know in the comments. And speaking of Billy, hashtag Billy has risen. That's right. Another giveaway. What we have here is the uh, G.I. Joe classified Red Ninja from, from our home tiers. We got a hashtag for that? No, we don't. No. Just read our Billy minds, has figure risen. it out. If you can't, yeah. then you just have no chance of winning. Yeah, so go ahead and drop that uh, hashtag Billy has risen in the uh, comments there. And what was the prize again? It was a, a bag of boiled joke. peanuts. There it is. And Dirk, if you're still with us, that rum raisin was a hit. Next time you're in the land of the rising sun, double down on them shits for van. Um, you heard it here first. Van loves rum yeah. and raisins, but the chocolate was not bad either. And uh, speaking of raisins, if anybody finds the uh, California raisin PVC figure with the boombox, send us a DM. Send it to us. We've got a great person we want to pass it along to. If you know, you know. George. George. Who? The purple. Us. The, the, I'm really? not even hungry at this point, but I really want to know what a lobster turtle turtle wearing thing. lobster that's tastes like. It's like turtle lobster, but there's a turtle on there too. Brad. That is yeah, that's, no, a that's a that's, that's yeah. A that's They're very bottom feeder. Brett's gonna try it first and oh. let us know how it tastes. Brett's taking the whole bag to his face live on the Purple Gang Gang live stream. If you want to try one, go. Just one. I I won't press it upon you, but I don't want to do it by myself. Look at Jordan, I'll have one. Right. <laughs> oh, shit, no. <laughs> I could smell that bag as soon as he opened it. I'm good. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Dirk, we apologize, but we don't eat uh, this thing. Turtle Gents. shrimp. <laughs> I can it don't smell taste it. like it smells. It does not taste like it smells. Mm. If, you, if you think I'm messing with it, here. Problem. This is the nastiest thing I've smelled here. Dr. Brent, Dr. Brent, Dr. Brent, Dr. Brent, Dr. Brent.
Dr. Brent, Dr. Brent, Dr. Brent, Dr. Brent. Take that bear. Oh, I mean, that bear. Yeah. It just kills him. Yep, yep. There you go. They were delicious. Thanks, loved them. Dirk. Loved them. Super good. If you get more, send them to Jordan and Brett. They got them. They love them. They want I love them so much. Can't I want enough. more. Absolutely. Yeah, so what do we got going on next? Ooh, Ooh. maybe a Dwarf Custom of the Week. Okay. Presented by the Toy Forge. I'm going to save these for Logan. <laughs> Logan's going to hate you so much. That's okay. That's I'll cool. I'll give him plenty more reasons. Oh, my goodness like gracious. So I here, can fuck with Wasabi. That was my F bomb. Uh, that's his one for the show. And uh, like I like to explain to people every single time we go to a bocce restaurant, Wasabi is actually just green horseradish. Um, I like it a horseradish. The green horseradish. So T -t tomato pie. Yeah. But the dwarf custom of the week this week. Ooh. Ooh. Is this this amazing, super dope, like barbarian Carolina blue uh, dwarf custom pop, by Jose pop, Torres? Pop, pork. I think it is. Speaking of pork, Boyer, uh, RIP, you got stabbed with an Aquaman trident, but what Smoke absolutely... him on a grill, douse him with some vinegar. Ooh, swine wine. Did we apple, have, the, did apple we have time barbecue for lunch, lunch today? Pop an apple in his good. mouth, I'll yeah. chew him yeah, till he's like done. Pork. It was. We had pork. We had brisket. Oh, I had potato salad and macaroni and cheese. I think somebody behind me had some hush puppies. Hush puppies were cornbread. Cornbread. Corn you going to finish that cornbread? Uh, hey, you I touch my cornbread, there will be consequences and repercussions. Yeah. Mm. Just like this Boyer experience. So big yep. shout out, Jose he tried Torres. tried to touch some cornbread. And you see what happened? This dwarf is dope. It's absolutely wonderful. We love it. Great so. photo. Keep doing what you're doing. So all the photos were great, first they and were. foremost. But look at how we painted this. Like nobody really sees us that much. W are we talking about art that inspires us, or uh, I don't know what you mean when you say stuff like that. I, I just I, I think about the things that we see as we stroll through social media and and how they make us feel deep down inside of us. They just give us those fuzzy warm oh, feelings. You didn't say that at first. I thought you felt it, though. I will continue making my army of lizard men. Yes. So yeah, um, you well, while well, y'all were uh, me. dealing with that, we were trying these pea snacks, pea snack seon. So apparently, uh, we're going SSJ tonight. As we uh, crunch down on these uh, peas, edamame, protein, dietary fiber, cow bay. They got a lot of promises going on with the package. But one thing I will promise you, they're delicious. Dirt, these are a winner. Those sound really good. Uh, oh, you said art that inspires? Sorry, there's a little bit of lag in here. Yeah, there's a lot of lag, but try those peas. Oh, shit, that's not right. Nope. That was a misfire, y'all. It happens. Don't yeah, judge us. it does. Brett, what are you doing? Stop clicking my mouse. Mm, mm, uh, mm. But here we go. Art that inspires. Art that inspires, right? It it talks to each and every one of us. This is like something It's like you see something that someone does and you're like, wow, I would really like to do that. And then a lot of people are like, ah, that looks like hard. I don't want people to see my work, you know, but like something to aspire to. Something that inspires you to get outside of your comfort zone, to just do something a little bit different. And this week's Art That Inspires is uh, <laughs> is actually <laughs> Jesus Billy. <laughs> <laughs> when did you make this? Oh, my God. So big shout out. Oh, my God. Uh, 
Billy has risen. I was just damned to hell for saying that image. Billy, uh, <laughs> he didn't take three days to come back. He was up the Toy next Box morning. Toy Box of Doom, I hope you're still in here for this one. He was up the next morning. But uh, <laughs> our actual art that inspires this week is our homie, Dub Dub 3. Dun, 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 dun. We absolutely love our homie, William Wallace Harris III. You can check him out on Instagram at La Certa Photo. You can see him in the cabal. You can see him everywhere where you see purple. This is our dude. He does absolutely amazing photography. He does absolutely amazing paint jobs on his custom figures. And he does all of this with a crutch that none of us have to experience. You know, if, if I don't have the best eyesight, then, you know, I, I make do. If, if I have shaky hands, I make do. This is some people's absolute reality every single day. And what do you do? Do you give up or do you push through it? Do you do, your, do, do, you do your best work? Yes. So big shout out, Dub Dub 3. We've got some absolutely amazing photography shots that he has actually posted Hold on, this before week. you say that, we have Brett Stoddard. Of tidy photography in here. What do you see when you look at the shot? <laughs> what do you see? You know, I, I do want to say, uh, Dub Dub, I've been seeing a lot of your concert photography up here? Um, over the years, um, and that's not a, that's there. not an easy thing to to do. Concert photography. You're in the pit. You got three songs, no flash, uh, constantly changing lights. It's it's amazing that you guys pull off what you do down there. Wow, that is a beautiful shot. Right? It really is absolutely amazing. The lighting, the smoke effects. Uh, just I'm a big fan of the over lighting on things. I don't even know what that means, but I believe you. When yeah, you say no, over yeah, no. Tidy's um, talking. Well, I'm listening. He lit it from above, not direct on, which would flatten it out, not from the sides. There's so that's not Hellfire. I thought it he, looks like Hellfire. I, I thought he traveled it. directly into the depths of hell to take the shot of Aerith here. Mm -hmm. But he didn't. Apparently, it's overlighting. You heard it here first. But Dub Dub Free, this is beautiful, bro. This is actually one of the Dirk's uh, Dirk's designs custom contest for photography entries, and uh, we showed it a little bit early. So you mean to tell me no souls were taken during the capturing of this image? Just one. Just one. Shang Tsung, if you're watching, uh, let us know in the Your comments. Soul is mine. No. Shut up, Mortal Kombat movie. Unless you look at that. Yeah. It's great. It's really a great image. We'll go ahead and print that off and uh, sell it. Uh, you right. know, give all the all the profits to Dub Dub Three because that's what we do. Right. Oh, and there's more. Oh my goodness gracious! Is this Thistle Thorn? Oh, of course we have more images. It'll pull up eventually on What's the big TV here for you. But oh. shout out to my Fuzz Monks and my Flannel Gang Gang. Look at this that absolutely car familiar. dope. Thistlethorn. Ooh, that card does look familiar. Where do you recognize it from? Uh, did Almeida make that? I don't, I don't know. It looks like a card from The Hobbit that uh, WW3 actually invented a shrink ray and shrunk down an actual mm -hmm. prop set and used it for his Thistlethorn photo with that absolutely amazing uh, wanted board behind him. Oh, so it, it speaks to me. This was like this shot right here is like so. it tells so much. Look at the shrubbery. All right. Shout out to uh, Monty Python, the Holy Grail. Absolutely. Shrubbery. Um, you know. If you enjoy the uh, landscaping that happened in this photo, uh, let us know in the comments, Walter. Mm -hmm. And just uh, a quick, uh, let's see here. Let's go ahead and. Uh, what do you got? I'm back over here just real quick. You got more stuff the, for us? Uh, oh, the Billy Has Risen giveaway. What was that giveaway again? I believe that giveaway was the blood of your enemies. Ha, ha, ha. Billy has risen. Shout out Easter tomorrow. Let me see. I don't know what this is. Yeah. This is a ninja, a red ninja. You want some more of these? Because I'm, I'm shredding this bag. Yeah, that's really cool. Looks like a lot of great parts that you Those can use for shrimp mythic uh, customization. No, I don't either. I wonder if this is one that... Uh, right, right. Or good you take the bag home, her? No, I don't want to move my car for eight hours. <laughs> Code Lavender, is this a red ninja that you need for your collection? That was a uh, middle finger, so that means he needs it. 
So let's go ahead. I have more than applause uh, if you need them, Curse. Just holler at me. Yeah, we'll rig this contest right now. I actually created a whole custom wheel. We did this many times where we created as many like fake profiles as we could. And mm -hmm. We did a bunch of like fake uh, wheel spins. Who is even the purple gang gang? Wait, what? I don't know. Yeah, you say so, something. Let's go ahead and spin this bad boy. We got a winner coming your way. And who is that dun, winner dun, gonna dun, be today? Dun, 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 dun. William, William Golan. Bum, 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 bum. You That's may, karma. You may remember William Golden from early in our episode for the huge shout out that we threw his way. Right? Uh, he's a good friend of ours. He's a good local friend of ours, but he really uh, came to you know came to town for us down in Toylana and helped us find some uh, some wonderful stuff that we were looking for. For our and, boy uh, LaGuardia, you know, but uh, William, you're a real one. I've got your address because you're a winner, bro. You already know, but right Ninja Winning coming your way, you know, share it with a homie, you know, feel free to pick off the accessories that you want to use for your own custom and then give away the rest of the stuff that you don't want to use. Absolutely. Purple brain brain, baby. There it is. So big shout out, William. We love you, bro. And uh, we've got a red ninja coming your way. So we talked about the color red. Have we talked about the color purple? We have actually, but you know what? Um, we actually have some more dope photos from Dub Dub Three. Oh, I like do that photo. inspires me the most. Uh, this right here is an actual uh, dope uh, orc centaur, and with a custom three D printed head that Dub Dub Three actually painted. And uh, I think it's dope. I think it's absolutely dope all around. So big I shout out Dub Dub Three. Like this speaks to me, bro. Like the blood on the horns. It's pretty heavy. I don't know why I'm seeing this, but I'm seeing X Pox from Generation X about to just hashtag suck it. Yeah, yeah, I see that too. Not no, nothing about this sucks it. But no, 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 no. It just, just like it it's, popped into my head. I it's just... like he's cocky. Look at that work with yeah. the horns. Like you can tell by the way that uh... he uses his walk. He's a ladies' man. No, <laughs> no time, time to, to talk. talk. Yeah, da -da -da. absolutely. Da -da -da -da. It was there, yeah. yeah. Purple brain brain. No, yeah, exactly. No. Brett's getting it. Yeah. Brett's getting it. He's uh, he's, he's finally syncing up yep. with our uh, schedule here. Yeah, no, no, our cycles have synced at this point. Our uh, oh my goodness, oh my our goodness. brain waves. That's what I'm wow. going to say. Yeah. Wow. None of people talk about Brett Sider's photography or his brain waves or his brain waves syncing with ours. Yeah, but we didn't leave that on screen for too long, yeah. so uh, not long enough. Deal. Wait, what did you say? I have me? no idea. I don't know what you said about me. Mm -mm. But, things um, were said words were said did, thoughts were had did you um feelings were felt who was that in the comments that asked what the purple gang gang actually meant what does purple gang gang mean to ask this question one must first look into what the color purple even means it's a color reached by the blending of two colors which can be described as the blending of what's best in humanity creating something that's aesthetically pleasing yet toned down Hence, bringing forth a community that stands out, but is also humble and wholesome. Purple Gang Gang. They're behind Purple us. Gang yeah. Gang, baby. G, we absolutely love you. Ba, and, ba, um, ba, purple. You explain it better than we ever could. So we appreciate you uh, for speaking our words with the Purple Brain Brain. I'm not good with words, but... When I when I do think of words, typically the words have already been said, but not you're not good with words. With but I know what love is. No, I feel them feelings. I just can't articulate them Sh sometimes. Shout out Forrest Gump. Yep. J J Jen A. Oh, there it goes overflowing. No, it doesn't. I did really good with that for that time. Shout out Brett Stoddard. Wait, what? <sighs> what else you got for me tonight? Man? I got a lot for you. What do you want me to give to you? I got it. Maybe you know some, what? I, maybe yeah, not. maybe no, not. no, no. That no. that's just where I wanted to go. I'm no, glad you went there. You read my mind. It Give it to me. I don't think it is. I do. I want to go there so bad. You don't even understand how bad I want to go there. Dan, if that's where you want to go, I keep wanting to reach for something that is in that category. So please, by all means. Oh my goodness gracious! So yes. Purple toys and customs and other purple stuff. Uh, real quick here. Oh, oh. Check out this beautiful photo right oh, here. Oh my. You may recognize this purple caravan caravan from the Obilia segments that you see here the past few weeks. Uh, Van actually spent some time and created a purple caravan caravan. Actually 
accurate to T. Uh, we can't find our Billy Beige sticker to throw on this. This is actually a one of two custom design by Tatted Toy Dude on Instagram. That's you, me. You can check him out on Instagram at Tatted underscore toy underscore dude on Instagram. He paints caravans purple with orange stripes. And he actually uh, pays attention to the undercarriage because that's a big point to us. We actually need good undercarriage. Hey, Maynard, I made that shit rusty. Details. He did. Absolutely. Shout out to the Rust King, Maynard. We love you, bro. Like, you're inspiring, too. Look mm -hmm. how rusty this is. Billy lives in this shit. Like, he shrinks himself down every night after he sells boiled peanuts. And uh, it's pretty much. Wait, there's more. Wait, there's more. What's more, man? Let's talk about that raccoon fur carpeting. Oh, raccoon fur carpeting. Yeah, raccoon fur carpeting throughout. Billy, where did you learn all these uh, useful real world skills? Let us know in the comments. Absolutely. I was so excited about that. Wait, I was what? busting at the seams. I'm so glad we got to share that with Billy. Yeah, Billy, we got uh, we may or may not have one coming your way, and it may. Or may not be filled with awesome goodies. Yeah, surprise goodies are going to be inside that caravan, Billy. Yeah, it could be uh, boiled peanuts. You don't know. Could be. Tune in uh, at a later date to find out. So, big shout out, Billy Bay. She's had some wonderful content from Toy Lana. He uh, recorded the entire Big Dub for Horseman Fan. He did. He uh, actually died from... Uh, Amir Kaspar at Toy Lana. He, did. he was murdered. He shot yeah. him with the blow dart flute. Uh, shout out Simple Tricks and Nonsense. Oh, uh, their, their cosplay is just top notch. John and Rebecca are absolutely wonderful. They are. They do great stuff great all people. around. But, um, Billy, we're sorry that you survived two weeks ago just to die last week at Toy Lana from the flute darts. And he came back, though. He did. Yeah. Billy has risen. Yep. Well, I mean, Kidpool was there, and, and Lord knows that. Uh, he, he's able to resuscitate like none other. Wait, are you trying to tell me that Kimpool blew into... I, I'm just saying that I saw Billy die, Kimpool was in the room, and Billy's not dead anymore. That's all I'm Shout saying. Shout out Kimpool. <laughs> Shout out Kimpool. Who collects Kimpool? It's Van Johnson, and I'm about to collect Kimpool. Purple gang gang. So Van collects Kimpool nonstop. Yes. I, I, I'm a bit of a fanatic. He does it every time. I gotta have Kimpool. He's so crazy. Yeah. That guy right he, there. He's, he's just a phenomenal person to collect. Why would you not collect Kimpool? Ooh, Billy just uh, publishes Toy Lana review. Everybody, check out Billy Beige Customs on YouTube. Check out that Toy Lana review. Absolutely. He's not dead. Billy has risen. And 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 selfless plug here. Billy, when you receive your package with uh, a custom, I believe the entire Purple Gang Gang looks forward to uh, hearing your review of the exterior and the interior and of the that undercarriage, custom. especially the undercarriage, especially the undercarriage. Billy, we need you. Cook, 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 crack. Oh, wow. Where did that come from? Mm. Gas oh. station rose. We're uh, still going over purple toys. Yeah. Oh, Tidy just had to go uh, tidy up for a minute. Tidy up for a minute. He yeah. actually accepted a uh, assassination contract. He's actually out killing people. He'll be back when he's done. With he's his camera. With his camera. He kills everything he touches. With a camera. Because he's magical. He is. Hashtag no stitches for stitches. Snitches, yes. Snitches. We're not so snitches. yeah, uh, more purple stuff here. We've got our good friend uh, oh. Wunderkammer Custom Toy Workshop putting on this absolutely super dope Skeletor Casey Jones Check repaint. It out, it's wonderful. He has a lot of great purple customs. Follow him on Facebook. Uh, we saw this actually. I think it was this morning. And we're like, yo, customizer like, group. Yo, that's super dope. Like, where does he come up with this stuff? He's brilliant. Like it. It kind of. Uh, most ambitious crossover. It since, resonated uh, with me. Since something else that was extremely ambitious that crossed over with another IP. But yeah, Ninja Turtles, Motu, we're here for it, bro. Yeah, oh, it's uh, the the actual hash or the Facebook group is Theory. That's T H I E R Y. Parrot Custom Toys is the Facebook page. 
all one world, one world, one world. It's actually on the screen right it's here. On the screen. It's Wondercom or Custom Toy Workshop. Well, yeah, but that's that now, like link you sent me earlier took me here. Buddy. It takes you there, but to type it in and get there, you've got to type in what I told you. Oh wow! That's why I was giving it to him. Oh wow! So no, yeah, cool. we listen together as a team and listen we make things happen. He's that's T H I E R Y Parrot. That's P A R R O T Custom. C U S T O M T O Y S, all one word. And that's the Facebook page that will arrive here. So, big shout out to our homie. He actually had some other cool I stuff. I dig the creativity, right? You know, I dug through his page for a little while today and uh, found What'd some other great with? stuff that he has here. Got some uh, Hero Clicks repainted here on the left, and we've right. got some super dope Rusty Skeletor action on the right. So, I really like these. You know, we like vintage toys, we love Mythic Legions, but. We love Motu, but these right here, they spoke to us. They're purple. Yep, yep. They're different. You don't see them every day. So, hey, bro, keep right. doing what you're doing. And uh, if it's purple, we've got love for you no matter what. And even if it's not purple, it's, you know, real recognize real. So keep doing what you're doing, bro. And uh, to our buddy Ishwar, um, I, I know you love the Mazinger Z. I happen to spy some great Mazinger Z uh, customs that he did on his page as well. So you're definitely going to want to I mean, obviously the purple is what lured me in, but we're all about lifting up others and, and you know, bringing it to community. And I know somebody who's near and dear to our community, Ishwar, uh, who's bringing the Ishkong our way. Yeah, shout uh, out you, to Ishkong. You'll love the Mazinger Z stuff. So definitely, definitely dip in there and check out what he's got. And, you know, th thank you for sharing your art with the community as well. Yeah, so big shout out. You're doing great work. We're proud of you. We love this. This is inspirational. If you sell any of your customs, let us know. We'd be happy to share it on the page uh, if we don't buy it all first. So, right. Love you, bro. Dibs on the skeleton. And speaking of Ishcon, uh, check out ishcon.net, August 3rd, Durham, North Carolina at the Durham Convention Center. There's lots of great news that's coming your way. Uh, we're not in a place right now to reveal that, but August 3rd, you don't want to miss it. Ishcon is going to have some of the most wonderful people in the entire history of the world. We'll be there. Ish will be there. Four Horsemen Studios will be there. It's a And, uh, you know, G is, has volunteered to teach Billy how to roll his R's. Not a lot of people know how to roll their That's R's. Really uh, amazing. We were going to do it, but who better to teach Billy than? Yeah, the, the man with all the R's in his name. Yeah, there's like 42 R's in G's name. Brought to you by the letter R. That makes me jealous. Me. That's beautiful. The things you do when you when you're just over there in the corner compiling these. Uh, yeah, y'all are seeing it for the first time. I'm seeing it for the first time. My reactions are genuine. That shit was funny to me. But you know, nobody says Echevarria as good as our good friend Curtis Code Lavender. How do you say it? It's your time. Shine, Curtis. Shine. I, I I just I can't roll it, so I just like stretch it out. It's it's. I feel like, like you're not giving. Varia. Give him all the screen. There's, there's all, the the screen. Other, screen. all the all screen. All the screen. Curtis. Oh my goodness, Curtis, you got this. I believe in you. I love. Are we? Are we still on? Is this? Are we live? Hi guys. Um, hey, uh, what's, what's going on? Um, say in the comments, what things you'd like me to talk about and stuff. The floor installation is great. It's complete. We've got the kitchen done and the living room done. And tomorrow I get to work on my collection. It'll be awesome. Thanks. Beautiful. Yes, it is real life, not AI. That would be wrong to use an AI as Curtis. Yes, flooring. Good. Heck yeah. Right, Dirk. Curtis, you are inspiring. And uh, G, go ahead and reach out to Curtis so you can go ahead and get him uh, in your uh, rolling R class with He Billy. needs to be in the class for sure. Arr, arr. If you can do a Chewbacca <laughs> noise, you can roll your R's. 
Curtis. Uh, what kind of Chewbacca noises you got? Uh, I I I don't have any Chewbacca noises, but I did just hear it from Darla across the room, and she is all for me signing up for that class. Is she okay. gonna? So okay. is she? Yeah. Does Darla, Darla have a? Hold up. Did I? Does Darla have a Chewbacca noise for us, or was it I, Darla? I don't think she does. Uh, she she almost made a Chewbacca noise uh, earlier when she threw her back out today, but Aww. Uh, we yeah. don't we don't make jokes at Darla's expense. Please stars. drop purple no. hearts in the chat for Darla, our yeah. spiritual yeah. sponsor in every single way. One of the sweetest humans babes, you will ever meet. Yeah, she's spread oh, out across Darla. the love seat right now. Uh, Ice just packs trying for Darla. To get her, her back to lighten up. Advil mm -hmm. for Darla. There you go. I love I, for Darla. I mean, listen, I know everybody loves Darla, but. If I find it kind of convenient that her back went out before we have to move all the detox tomorrow, <laughs> so I'm just saying, you know, <laughs> you know, now all of a sudden I get to do it all. So just we're taking Curtis off the screen because he's talking. Yeah. You know, Darla, we love you. In the event that you have a screen in front of you, Darla, I want you to see all the purple hearts that are here for Darla right now. So Curtis can whine about those detox that, that he wanted. He wanted those detox. Those are not Darla's detoffs. Those are Curtis's detoffs. So you you rest up, Darla. You enjoy watching Curtis move his own fucking detoffs. Detoffs. That was my f bomb. Yeah. Just use my f bomb. That was Tidy's f bomb. That was Tidy's f bomb. Brett, we're yeah. sorry if you're in the comments watching. You're done with your f bombs. You can't use one. I'm saving mine for the perfect opportunity. I got a little wound up. I got a little wound up. I get a little defensive. Oh my when, goodness yeah. gracious. We got you, darling. What are you even talking about I right now? I have no now? idea. I'm just saying words. What kind of words are you saying? All the words. All the words need to be said. I wish that I had Jesse's basement. 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 Hey! hey! We got tidy. We brought him back. He tried to run away, but he did not realize that Rosie was on the job, and she she's bit the to... shit out of him. Yeah, yeah, she's a spry little doggy. My ankles will never be the same. Nope, nope, not at all. She did try to try to show up and and act aggressive as shit when you first came here. And how long did that assert, last? Yeah, she tried to assert dominance. Didn't last very yeah, long. Yeah, no, she's she's she comes across intimidating when she wants to be, but there's zero. Zero bite behind that bark, unless you're Logan. She did try to mull his face today, but he had it coming. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you stick your fingers in my nose, I might bite you too. Yeah. I mean, well, he gets a little rough with the with with the way he he. Yeah. I mean, it's anyways. You know. Kids, what are you gonna do with them, right? Yeah. So uh, I I don't know if you noticed uh, we're plus one tidy minus one Jordan. Brent is actually giving him a kidney transplant as we speak. Um, uh, mm, no anesthesia. None needed. None needed. Jordan was already numb. So thank you Do to Dr. Brent, the official doctor of the Purple Gang Gang, for uh, giving us life, giving us internal organs, and giving us Jordan. Because um, without you, he would not be here. You, uh, you weren't here for us when Billy went down, but... You know, you, you brought a kidney for Jordan, so uh, that's good stuff. Shout out to Dennis Derby for delivering Curtis. Yes, thank you, Dennis Derby. We appreciate all that you do uh, in reference to bringing us Curtis. Not only does he customize, but he delivers Curtis. He delivers Curtis's. He delivers customs. He delivers uh, beautifully, almost translucent, but not. Uh, translucent there i am slurring and i, and I haven't even had the drink y'all i just can't fucking talk good but uh his hair it's uh i don't i, I lack the words it's almost like uh harp strings it's like harp strings in hair and, and they, they're melodic his hair if you strum his hair the next time you see dennis strum his hair lovingly and the uh the sounds that 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 emit from those strums are uh it, it's like uh, mermaids making sweet love under warm ocean waters while a uh, crab's watch. Hey, Dennis, would you mind if we flew next to your car? We think it'll get you better fuel efficiency. Absolutely. Better fuel efficiency than a Geo Metro. Pulling a purple a caravan, yeah. man. Yeah, so big shout out Dennis Derby, our, uh, our muse. 
appreciate you. Appreciate you what you do. You know, I think it was Jesse who said he once uh, sat in silence for 836 days. Something like that. Something like if that. If you're in the comments, Jesse, explain what you once said. No, he's not here. So, uh, you know, anybody has a great uh, interpretation of what Jesse meant? Let us know. Dirk, you're absolutely on the money there. If you do stroke Dennis's <laughs> hair, please say that shooting the shelf sent you. And Otherwise, he will Johnson. rip your throat out. It's and, true. Uh, you never sneak up on a man who's been in a chemical fire. Heard it here first. I've seen V for Vendetta. It does not end well. I know that's right. This is true. Oh, my goodness gracious. Do we have more uh, more purple toys and purple stuff? Ooh, and ooh, I other like purple stuff? things. What do you got? Speaking of Dub Dub 3, oh. wow. Not only is he art that inspires, he has made his way onto the purple ooh. toys. Wow. Another purple stuff category. That's like, this. oh, sorry. No, absolutely. You no, I just with I, I see this image and I think of you and me poolside because that's Shit. pretty much what I'm seeing. <laughs> Sebless and Ward, <laughs> shout out, shout out to the brood. Shout out Steve Obeg. If you like vampires, if you like purple, check out uh, the brood Facebook group. It's got vampires and they're purple. So join that group. Oh uh, yeah, I love the backlighting on that too. Oh my goodness! And uh, what do you see when you look at it? Brett, tell me. Tell me more. Look in your heart first. It's important. Oh, yeah, break down the image. It, it'll, took it it'll away. Come back, there it is. It'll come that back, image. Up. You just there hang is. on. It's your horses. Very well done. Tell us about what the purple. Is, what about the purple? You like the purple? I do like the purple. He yeah. likes the purple. The purple rim lighting, the purple backlight, the purple. <clears throat> you got to tone it down for our audience. You can't use like industry terms. Yes, that's that's way too intelligent. So I, I'm going to give you the layman. So I know the color of those figures are in fact grayish white, right? And I know that he's using purple. He's using purple lighting, but how do you hit those tones without just like overdoing it? Because I would overdo it. Those, those. Well, he probably has lights that he can control the output. Ah. Oh. So if it was me, I would set my key light, which in this case is possibly the light above and in front coming down. Okay. Key and then bring front, in the yeah. other lights and start lighting them and adjusting the output level based off of what he wants the final image to look. Dub Dub Three, is that how you did this? I mean, are you second guessing Brett Stoddard? Shut up. Shut up. I would Shut mean, up. We I don't mean, second guess the Brett major Stoddard. Major shadows are definitely lit from above. Yeah. I mean, well, that's the thing. I mean, I, I would not be able to, something would have gone drastically wrong had I taken this photo. Not and really. You just sit there and practice and get lights that have variable output so you can adjust it. And just keep pushing the button and trying things. And I'm great at pushing trying buttons. Trying new things. And if you know the great thing about digital, if the one doesn't work, you can take it again, adjust something, and you don't have to wait until you develop the film and realize it sucks before going back to it. So that's pretty cool. That's one of the beautiful things about digital. Yeah, Top sh light is brighter. Shout out first. Google. Yeah, that's beautiful. There it is. Great photo. Awesome photo. All right. Uh, let's see what the uh, next purple uh, toy is here. We got purple toys coming our way. Oh my goodness gracious. Is this another dub dub three photo? I it's think it is. Dub. Dub three. Hallelujah. It's raining dub. So what do we got Photography. here? Is that a Marvel Legends X-Men Wolverine? It looks under like purple a... lighting. Shing. It's not. It's a Valiant Knight. Oh, thwick. It's a Valiant Knight. Oh. I lied. If you believe me, let me know in the comments. But it's uh, not a Wolverine. It's actually a Valiant Knight with dope purple lighting from our dude, Dub Dub 3. Oh, um, like the purple, my favorite thing about it is that he controlled his depth of field to make the background knights slightly out of focus to keep your eye drawn to the guy in the middle. That's dope. But you still slide out and see the back ones, but you're always brought back to the guy in the middle. And normally they say don't put your subject right in the middle, but in this case, I think it's a great place to put the subject with the nice symmetry going on because it really divides the image into thirds. And this right it here does. is why we always talk about Brett Stoddard's photography because he knows to do these things and, and he recognizes when other people do things well because he's purple and he lifts others up. So, uh, you yeah, know, Dub Dub 3, you Big, killed it. Uh, Curtis, Big Dub will never become Medium Dub. He mm -hmm. will always be Big Dub. Shout out mm -hmm. Big Dub. 
Shout out, Big Dub. How does that make you feel, Big Dub? My loins. Moist. So you heard it here first. Dub Dub 3 will always be Dub Dub 3. And Big Dub will always be Big Dub. Shout out, Big Dub. You're a great one. Did Next we talk about this last week? He catered the most delicious Whee! southern barbecue yes. that I've ever had. I lived in the South for 862 years, and I've never had a catered mm -hmm. meal quite like the one Big Dub catered. Shout out Big Dub. Shout out Big oh, Dub. He had the most delicious them. barbecue, the most delicious potato salad. There was macaroni and cheese. Uh, not enough people talk about Brett Stoddard's eggs. Wait a second. I didn't click that. Who hacked our stream? <laughs> hippity hoppity, hippity hoppity. Hip hop and you don't stop a rock into the bang bang boogie set up, jump the boogie to the rhythm of the boogie beat. Oh, Brett, how does that make you feel? What's with the stupid rabbit suit? You What's wore up with that, that stupid human up? suit? Yeah. Hashtag Donnie Darko. You want to take a bite of this? No. no? It yeah. sounds like a great time for a giveaway. What do we got going on here, Van? While I um, eat this random chocolate we have nugget thing that you gave on me. card Marvel Legends. It smells like brownie. Storm figure. That's right. <laughs> she controls the weather. That's Magento. Oh, it's Magento. Is that yeah. Iron Man? It is. It might be Iron Man. Oh, wait, wait. No, I, I know this guy. I know this guy. Um, um. Walker, Texas Ranger. No, Close. almost. Superman. Yes. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Yep, we got it. With his metal gauntlets, after years of self-imposed exile, Spider-Man is back. Now calling himself Ben Riley and sporting a brand new costume and web shooters. The wall crawler returns to fight crime. A uh, press siete exile pendant diez años Spider Man. Oh, okay, I'm done. Yeah. Yo, this one's really Let's good. Go. I want. Yeah, I want to get in on that. <laughs> no, bro, this one's mine. I'm eating this whole thing. You shouldn't have passed it to me before you took a bite first. Ha ha ha, bitch! <laughs> try it. It's good. Do you want part of this part? He's got. You can try some other yeah, hands. Yeah. Cause I'm not sharing. Sure. Yeah, there we go. That's. It's like that's a brown awesome. churro that's. It looks like fecal matter, but I'm sure it doesn't taste like it. It's good. It's oh, really good. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> Shout out, Dirk. Shout out, Dirk. Hashtag Dirk's custom contest. We need your, more Dirk. Your favorite Japanese Less snacks. snacks. Less prawn crackers, more oh, these things. Yeah. It looks like a brown star. Hmm. Jason, maybe um, uh, maybe we'll send you a random piece of chocolate. Less, with less your prawn ninja. chips and more chocolate starfish. You heard it from Brett. Ooh, Jason, maybe we'll send you some shrimp chips. Mm. Let us know in the comments if you're allergic to shrimp. Otherwise, uh, we're going to send them to you regardless. Somersault in the pool. Hashtag that somersault really in good. the pool for your really chance good. to win this Hank McCoy Beast retro carded figure. Bam, 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 bam. Uh, asterisk disclaimer what you see is what you get don't listen to our words because sometimes they're inaccurate english is a second language yeah we don't speak possibly english normally third. google translates extremely slow but here's your chance brought to you to by ai shrimp chips and this wonderful hank mccoy beef figure so yeah Go ahead and drop that hashtag. I'm summer salt in the mold. While we eat more delicious Kirk snacks. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Big bag no, those of are cats. special. Those are really special. We don't eat those. No. We're going to gild those in bronze and we're going to actually uh, staple them to the wall. The Japanese know how to do a Kit Kat. They oh, do really they? Do. What's wrong? Yeah. yeah. Check it out. Hashtag, hashtag Funk So Brother. Check it out now. All kinds of different flavors. Like mochi? I have no idea what mochi is. I don't but know I'll what try you it. just said, but it touched me in the heart. Right? right. Oh my god, this is so good. This thing is so good. It's so good, dude. It's oh my so god. Good. I'm not even sharing this. Here's what's left of the packaging after uh I crushed the chocolate uh mm. nugget that was in mm. here. All right. 
screenshot that one. Go ahead and uh, screenshot this right now and run it through your Google Lens. So Mochi's not a favorite, to, but uh, I'm not mad it. at it. It's not horrible. No, it's not horrible. What does Mochi even mean? If you know, let us know in the comments. It was weird. I don't know what it was. It just wasn't. It's fun, but. Yeah, it's not bad. I just, I probably wouldn't go out of my way to try it again. That's well said. Ooh, that one's good. It looks like strawberry cheesecake. Yeah, strawberry cheesecake kicks ass great. Apparently, we look like a bunch of raccoons digging through that box. Barry's <laughs> plan worked perfectly. Right. You know what? Mm -hmm. It did. That was this good, was right? Wonderful. That was good. Good one to end it on. Yeah. No. Uh, strawberry cheesecake for win. I'm totally feeling like a raccoon digging through a box looking for my last. Absolutely. Meal before I get hit by a car as I run across the street <laughs> trying to so find the next that. dumpster <laughs> to, <laughs> to, to eat raccoons. the next. Uh, Random delicious chocolate snack. Yeah. Shout out dirt. Yeah. This is so good. Oh my god. That's this right. I don't best. even care if people are watching at this point. I just yeah. want to enjoy these kick cats. Yeah. You're gonna watch us for the okay. next 40 minutes. I, don't know. I can't read delicious snacks. Let's see. Well, you, we give away I toys. Fuck, I'm showing the floor is what it is, but oh problem. It's not as good as strawberry cheesecake, but it's, it's good. I think he hit the nail with it. Yeah, it's definitely raspberry. Mm. I like this that. So good. I like that a lot. This is so good. Which one is that? <laughs> You'll never Maybe know. <laughs> Man, son of a bitch. I'll burn this whole fucking house down. <laughs> There's my one. <laughs> Trash pandas. Come again? <laughs> yeah, we took yours <laughs> while you were gone. Let me know. <laughs> yeah. Which one did you eat? I just I really needed to know now. <laughs> it was... Uh, start with the green. Yeah, there. You get mochi. Then you get... I don't want the matcha latte. I don't know. That's not it. That shit. Hit me with some of that deliciousness. Oh, this one. That was good. This looks like strawberry cheesecake. Dude, it was great. Mochi's not bad. That was the other Different. one, right? Was, that, was it this one? Yeah. Yeah. There's two we like. We didn't try the white one. Mm -mm. Yeah, if you want this, you can't have it. It's mine. I don't know what this one would be. And that one next. Oh. There we go. Boom. And while everybody's typing in uh, hashtag somersault in the pool, we're going to eat Kit Kats. We're going to eat Kit Kats. But wait, I think there's more purple toys and other stuff that might be purple. Bum, 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 bum. Shout out to our homie Ray Ray, Raylan. He painted this super dope octopus yeah, octopus head. Like white chocolate, maybe? It matches the no. uh, Operative 83 uh, the Cosmic figure. Better. Yeah. Super Probably well, the Ray yeah. Ray. We're super proud of you. You're doing That's a great job, buddy. It. You are doing an absolutely great fan. job. So, um, keep up the great work, buddy. This is absolutely wonderful. We're a big fan. And C -c 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 crack, C -c 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 crack, N 94, boys. Woo, 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 woo. woo. So big shout out Ray Ray, and that's actually our homie Ray Ray right there with a the Kraken. Raylan painting those dope octopus heads as we eat delicious Kit Kats. And which I one have you broken into it yet? I just it's opened the package yeah. and I'm gonna eat it here live. We want to watch you enjoy it. I'm PGG Live. Join us uh, and watching Jordan enjoy the uh strawberry oh. cheesecake Kit Kat. He can take it off. Yeah, he did. Oh, good. Zero gag reflex. That looks so good. It's good, right? Well, I'm not sure. Yeah. Water. Yeah. He's going to wash it down with that. Let's go wake up my wife who's allergic to artificial strawberries and see if she likes it. Mm. Mm. No, wow. They no. might use real. We'll find out the hard way. The strawberry cheesecake Kit Kat, like, Kicking your neighbor's door and look through their pantry until yeah. you find one. That, if yeah, your that, first neighbor doesn't have one, check the second neighbor's house. Don't stop until you get check them. Check the third neighbor's house. They have Mythic Legions. Grab them because you're going to need them for the uh, Pop and Swap All Stars contest that's about to go live. Uh, or to trade them for strawberry cheesecake Kit Kats. Oh my Jesus, those are good, <laughs> right? <laughs> that was really good. Do you have any plans? Have you been I thinking about do. anything? This year that opened up uh, last year kind of limited me because they, they kept doing the. The, the, one must be this, a builder, and one must be that. 
and now this year with the moping up to it can be any three three figures it, it kind of gives me a little bit more leeway doesn't it still have to be a builder though no of no the three we don't know they haven't announced the rules yet i was listening to them the other day uh on one of my commutes to work and I, i'm pretty sure and trevor if you're in the comments correct me if i'm wrong but uh nate uh bill you two uh but i believe they said uh specifically any three figures they removed the builder requirement uh for this year so yeah we well, might have said that, feed you. but we don't know that until they actually uh, post them, you know, because things change. And, uh, you know, well, since, I'm going to wreck the place if it changes. And since we've already played the video, we have no uh, assurance that they're actually watching at this point. <laughs> None. Yeah. You know, they already knew what we had in store. But wait, is there more? Do we make another video? Did we? A secret video for a secret, secret video? A secret video to rule them all. Oh, so devious. Or is it the same video that we're going to play anyways right now? Like that. And there's um, Nate doing his Van Johnson oh, impression right I? there. <laughs> I think that's what I was doing. Hey, Big Dog. Big Dog. How does that make you feel, Big Dog? Makes my loins. Moist. It should. It, it, yeah, I yeah. felt the same way. It really should make your loins. Loins? Loins, yeah. Two syllables. L O I N S. Yeah, no, when in Georgia. Loins. Georgia. Moist. Everything has an extra syllable name. Georgia. Yes. Hey, I think it might be a great time the to go ahead and spin this giveaway. Who sings the Georgia song? Let us know in the comments. Is it Jamie Foxx? Billy Ray Cyrus. Billy Beige Customs. You heard yeah. it here. Billy Beige, uh, record us, uh, record you singing uh, Georgia. And send it to us. We'll play it next week. Yeah, and if you want to sub in Mississippi, that's great too. Actually, that, that would be phenomenal. Same thing. Yep. <laughs> the real audio is devastating. So devastating on that fall. It was Billy. It was devastating indeed. Glad you didn't die, my friend. Logs is awesome. Is that like eighteen weeks in a row that you won a prize? Starting with Billy Beige falling out of that chair. Tell me your manifestation powers. Absolutely, Logan. Like, tell me. What are your secrets? This man is a winner. What are your secrets? Because this is literally the third week in a row. That you just want a bag of uh, prawn shrimp chips. chips. Shrimp chips coming Shout your way. Shout out logs. You're getting shrimp chips. Yep. I'll resell uh, the bag for you so they'll be extra fresh. You have to rewatch the entire episode to see what the real giveaway was. It uh, was prawn chips. It was prawn chips the whole time. Yep. So make Always sure you're uh, in the United States. We know you subscribe because you just win everything we can really? buy, buddy. Sprinkle the prawn chips in everybody's package this week. You know, one prawn chip. and uh, to be eligible to receive Dust these it. prawn chips, uh, it. record yourself kicking in your neighbor's door and uh, tell them shooting the shelf sent you. Tell them shooting the shelf sent you, and we'll send your prize package out of your prawn chips immediately. This is true. That's what we do. Okay, keep tuning in. Keep winning prawn chips. Yeah, you're yep. a real one. From the land of the rising sun to Rollsville, North Carolina, to wherever you're at in the world, prawn chips coming your way. Prawn chips? Who's, Delicious prawn chips. Who's, why are we talking about prawn chips? I can't talking stop about? talking about prawn chips. Prawn Swanson? Ooh, prawn Swanson. Parks and Rec? Ron Absolutely. Swanson, if you're watching and you'd like to dress up as a shrimp and cosplay as... Prawn Swanson, let us know in the comments. 
<laughs> oh, shit. I read that book as a child. It's great. Yeah, we're going to bake you in our oven. You ate way too many sweets, yeah. Shout out Dirk for sending us all these delicious sweets. He did. Makes us a lot uh, slower to run Are you away. implying that he's going to throw us in an oven? If he does, I'm here for it. Cook me at 450 for at least an hour. Otherwise, you're going to get some nasty, nasty meats. I am just not really going to joke anything further. I, I'm stopping at him throwing us nothing, and I'm done. Uh, what did huh, the, I'm done. Well done. <laughs> I will be able to cook me for an hour at 450. But what did Ivan Drago say? If they die, they die. That happened. Yeah. Oh, yeah. my God. This smells like... Bitch, eat it. <laughs> it's not bad. Tidy's yeah. No, piece. even Tidy's telling you it's not bad. It's, it's, it's not bad. Yeah, it's not a prawn chip. Try this Kratom flavored Kit Kat. <laughs> I'm recovering, bro. Kratom? Bro, smell this shit. Tell me it doesn't smell like some fucking. I don't know. God, it's too. Just try it. Comments, give me your it's not bomb. bad. I Redeem promise me. it's not bad. I mean, I'm more that Kratom Kit Kat. Hey, man, it's, it's legal, man. <laughs> the Kratom Kit Kat is killing me, dude. <laughs> he said I'm recovering. Who the fuck would make this? <laughs> yes. Ooh, the same people that brought you prawn chips, dude. Like, what do you want? <sighs> I have a whole bunch of inappropriate things I can say right now. <laughs> So what? rush out to your 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 closest Starbucks and and I try the matcha really lavender. Yeah, wash it down with the raspberry is great. You have oh. this one if you like it so no. much, Brett. <laughs> oh yeah, you don't like. Hey, Popeye, oh. I'm getting spinach Kit Kats. Uh, is, is matcha spinach? <laughs> I don't want it. It's like a tea thing because I saw that at Starbucks when we were in Toyland last week and we took that photo of the matcha. Oh, you're nasty. <laughs> oh, you know what it tastes like. You had some. Ooh, more. Call me Miss Jackson. Woo. Van is for real. Oh my god, that's it's so not gross. a bad. This is not a grape. That's kind of like your opinion too, though. Favorite. It was my least favorite. No, no, prawn chips are my least favorite. Oh well, yeah, but like goes about saying. Yeah. You just open the bag to know that that was good. Why would you do this to and me? And I ate like six. <laughs> Why would you do this to me? I oh my goodness gracious! Point. Is there another purple toy? I think there is. Ooh, I don't like what's going on. Shout here. out Michael Hanley for yes. creating this super dope rhino with a purple cape cape. Uh, go ahead and read that, Van. Use your uh, English lessons. That I did built, some revamping on an old custom in preparation for the Foxes wave. His name is Brom, the black personal bodyguard to Malachi Cinderhorn. Unlike the Shadow Minotaur Torian, he cannot use magic, but he has transformed and enhanced by it. He is stronger, faster, and has already thick hide has become even harder to penetrate the last picture is the original version and there's a picture of his tattoos uncovered in the comments Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. <laughs> i want to subscribe and get more of this content seriously super dope spicy Rhino, super dope purple cape cape the color scheme goes absolutely wonderful together and uh you heard van read it and let's have him read it again Ooh. One more time. One more feeling so, this time, Van. Was there not enough feeling last time? No, I didn't really feel like the penetration part. You need to use <coughs> your hands. I got you. Hold up. Hashtag often ghoul. Let me get this. Oh, uh, you just delicious. <laughs> the non-green one. <sighs> Here we go. I did some revamping on an old custom in preparation for the Poxis wave. His name is Ron the Black personal bodyguard to Malachi Sender. Wait, 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 wait. <gasps> From the black personal bodyguard? That's what it said. Unlike the Shadow Minotaur, Torion, he cannot use his magic, but he is transformed and enhanced by it. He is stronger, faster, and already thick. Hide has become even harder to penetrate. The last picture is the original version, and there's a picture of his tattoos uncovered in the comments. There it is. 
wow the part where you're like hard and penetrates and all that other stuff it really spoke to me hey guys i am at mesquicon um there is the wolf king booth over there you see jesse uh well a few minutes ago jesse went to the bathroom and when he did i kidnapped his goat <laughs> like the way he's reading it you know what i tried i tried y'all not once not twice maybe three times i don't know maybe not i'm not sure i don't press the buttons around here i just you know you, you feed me a cracker hey, um, hey uh just uh wanted to follow up um as the official um teenage mutant Ninja turtle of the purple gang gang donatello um he is the purple one so I'm glad you got them. I'm still, I'm still trying to get me a set. I'm glad you got the purple one that you wanted. Yep, Curtis. It's, how much uh, did you pay for that? He looks great. Uh, one fifty. Oh, that's fair. Yeah. So. That's fair. Yeah, and he is the cool one. So anybody out there that says uh, Raphael, um, sorry, you're, you're wrong. wrong. Yeah. Yeah. I'll preach, Jinx. Um, pinch, poke, you owe me a coat, Curtis. We got a request for the lizard man. I'm not really sure. Alberto, a, a winner in the past, I believe he had an Alberto amazing Morales. Custom. He might have did. Did he have a custom sent up his way? I feel like he did. Maybe. Well, I will continue making my army of lizard men. Yes. Yes, absolutely. Yes. It gets me in the feels every time. Curtis, come on. Nate, if you're watching, let us know in the comments how many lizard men you've customized. I'm curious myself, yeah. He's not in the comments, but he actually just sent me a purple brain brain message and uh, none. He has a very busy personal life and he's doing a lot of things right now, but there will be lizard men created in the next few months. So I, I'd like to get him on the show and, and talk to him about uh, lizard men. Just like right now in my head, thinking about it, it just feels like every time he says anything at all, I would just like cut him off with the I Lizard Man that. video, and it might be a little There's frustrating a for him. So <laughs> <laughs> I, I hear that throughout the week, and it's it it, it haunts my dreams, and I have zero regrets. Yeah, but no, uh, those Lizard Man noises are actually real noises that uh, Nate recorded, um, and he played those after he. Uh, did those you know animations so that that's all nate all day long right. like that's not purple stuff that's nate stuff yeah and another fun fact you know we blink uh vertically but nate horizontally explain that i can't do that right now mm -hmm. you can't send me an email bullet points what exactly what you need powerpoint i will google it I will plug some of these uh, prompts into my chat GPT. I will get back to you with an answer that makes sense. It's true. But don't put me on the spot like that. We'll fabricate an answer and make sure that you get the answer that you need and deserve. Don't put me on the spot like that. The lizard people can't roll their R's like nobody's business. So sure. shout out lizard people. Absolutely. Um, did you say something about... Uh, no, I did not. No, did I was going to wait it. another seven minutes before I even mentioned That's whatever you're talking about. That's a really good plan. I do want to take another shameless plug. Uh, I don't know. Actually, you know what? Let's see what technology can do. Because I am a boomer. But let's see. We got a lot of things going. Oh, ha have, I, have I hit the maximum zoom? Yeah. Are you using the uh, black box that gets us all the free pay-per-view channels uh, from 25 years ago? Oh, hey, you know uh, what? I That's a can't. really good point. Yeah. Put in more than you take from the community. Oh, I like we that. We often have people that just take, 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 take. Then you've got mm. other great people that 
give, 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 give. So do the right thing. Give more than you take. Give more than you take. And uh, that those are wise words, and we we believe them, and we follow them wholeheartedly. So if you're out there and you're just like you start thinking about how much you give versus how much you take, and you're like, man, I'm on the the more taking side. Maybe stop that. Maybe give a little bit. Maybe try and you know balance the yin and the yang. Maybe mm-hmm. do the right thing. What would Brett Stoddard do? Give, give, and take a phenomenal photography. That's we all know. Always gonna take her picture. It's true. He clicks buttons, but he knows so much before he clicks that button. There's preparation. There's actions. There's math. Science. I don't know. No geometry. But um, yeah, definitely give more than you take. If you're taking more than you give, purple drones are watching you. Mm-hmm. That's not what the cabal can do for you. That's what you can do for the cabal. Amen, Curtis. Don't be greedy. Give to the needy. Hashtag Curtis. You're a real one, buddy. You're doing great stuff. Not only when you're on 18 different lives every single week, but the, At the other same time, the other 32 lives that you're not like physically on screen, but you're there supporting every single person. You're there spreading your goodwill your positive purple vibes. You're giving people advice that they should probably listen to. And, you know, they might be one of those people that are just take, 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 take. And they're like, who's this guy sliding into my DMs like I'm Ishwar? You don't do that. You give, you give, you give. Curse reaches out to you and gives you some super positive purple advice. You should probably take it. It's the right thing to do. So big shout out, Curtis. We love you, brother. You do great stuff. You are ex- actually extremely wholesome. You put on some serious kayfabe vibes. Look at that thumbs up. Look at that thumbs up. That was the most wholesome thumbs up I have seen all night. It's beautiful. Makes me feel good. I've seen a lot of thumbs go up, but not quite like those. We've seen toes go up on our show. We Shout have. out <laughs> Billy Beige. The chair keeps spinning and Billy is a winning. You know, everybody's like... Everybody's yeah. like, yo, in the stream, the dude died. In the stream, the dude died. I you see the chair spinning. Billy, you bastard. I knew Billy was fine. Billy's a real one. Billy is an absolute real one. I know, right? Yeah. I know that's true. I know that's right. Mm. 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 Yeah. A whole um, lot of great things mm. are happening. Hey, mm. if you're out there in the chat right now, can we get some purple hearts for Billy just for the way he persevered after taking that uh, three gallons of purple punch to his face and the uh, the floor also to his face. And and he still got up the next day, put his pants on one leg at a time. and Very and slowly, mind you. Quite slowly. Flung open the door of that caravan and, and, and bellowed out into the world. I'm alive! <laughs> just like that, actually. It's just like that. Our drones saw everything. Yeah. And you'll see more of our drones next week. On yes, you will. On Live. We've got drones. We have purple drones. There's two of them that we still have here at the headquarters. But we have actually like 3,872 drones As of that today. are actively deployed. Watching each and every one of you, your grandparents, uh, as well as various members of the toy community. Uh, We can't let you know who it is, but if you see like a birds, the birds aren't real. Those are actually purple drone drones. So evade them, hit them with your broom, uh, capture them with a net. If you do, they will explode. So you will never have proof, Mm -hmm. but uh, they're out there. (coughs) Quite amazing the things that happen. There's actually one floating behind Brett right now. True. That's he why he it. Not, it, He turned too slowly. He did. Really just like that, it was gone. So just know that. Whoa. And uh... and whether you enjoyed this show or not, the algorithm enjoys being fed while you're here. Please be so kind to hit the like button. Whether you liked it or not, I'd like for you to like me for a moment. And just like that button. Ooh. Do it for Billy. We'll Do guilt Billy. trip you. If you don't like this stream right now, Billy will die. Click that like oh. button. Save Billy's don't life. Don't kill Billy, y'all. Don't no, kill Billy. Don't do it. At 500 followers, 
I've got another Chernobyl print at home. Shut up. That I will donate and give the winner at Legion's Con. What? Or if they're local to me, I'll give them to them before Legion's Con. Or if you're not local and you're willing to drive, reach out to us. We have to screen you first. He must be protected at all costs. He is mm -hmm. a national treasure. You've seen his photography. You know what we're talking about. We're just not talking absolute nonsense right now. Photography um, is we'll vet point, you, and if you're you're willing to make the road trip and you're not local and he doesn't already know you, like I said, we'll we'll send you a, like a questionnaire, a survey. Uh, we'll have lots of people on the next live stream vote on it uh, to make sure that you're just you're safe and that Brett's safe. So you're a sweetheart, bro. Like that's that's Appreciate wonderful, you, buddy. Yeah, you've you, you really been here do. since day one, lifting us up. Day zero, bro. Yep. Day zero. That was such a wonderful morning at like. Was it two thirty three a.m. <laughs> <laughs> like the floor, August, Ohio, oh, bro? That was wonderful. That's good times. I will never forget it. Like, who's this guy in the hallway? He's like, it's one of us. That's who he is. Love you, love you, bro. Love you, bro. This man gets some early, dude. All around. So yeah, you heard it here. Uh, once we hit five hundred subscribers, Brett Stoddart will be giving away one of his super dope metal. It's a metal. It's That's aluminum. Aluminum. Prince. Illuminati prints. Very lightweight. Nice matte texture. Built in. Slides on the bag. Frame rail. Easy to frame on your wall. And uh, Don't frame these, please, for the love of God. Do not put one of these inside of a wood frame. That would break my heart. That would break his heart. But uh, you take these little Don't go breaking off. Brett's heart. Um, Don't go breaking Brett's heart. heart. They're really sharp, and you can take down your enemies you with a quick slash. I've seen it happen. <laughs> Shout out your cutters if you want. Shout out Ninja Scroll. Jube, you're a real one. But no, the picture quality is absolutely wonderful. And that is a, an absolutely sincere gesture, Brett. We appreciate it. And uh, maybe we'll hit 500 by next week. And if we don't, uh, we'll, there's always it'll, it'll there's always the next, next weekend. Week. It might be something creepy like a uh, room full of bassinets and an infant ward and an abandoned hospital in Ukraine. That's not creepy. That's love. Oh wow! Speaking of love, I love Deluxe Dwarf Legion Builders, and I love giving this away to somebody. Oh shit! And Dub Dub Three said he'll donate a Gorgo Bordello photo because you do concert photography. Nice. Have you actually? What? Have you actually filmed, bro? What? That's crazy. Purple Brain Brain. Yeah. What? Start wearing purple. What? Oof. Dub Dub Three, we absolutely need to talk about this concert. Send me a DM with like the links to the the album for this concert photography. We definitely need to talk about it. Like you're blowing my mind right now. And Dirk Designs, uh, he he brings forth an excellent question that I've actually wondered myself. You know what? If you check the description of the YouTube video, we actually put a link up to. El Tidy Photography on Facebook, but Brett, what else do you have to say yeah, about it? I, I used to have a, a website where I kept all of the stuff. Uh, I took it down, um, but if you reach out to me, I can show you gallery upon gallery, um, and yes, everything is purchasable. Um, yeah. I know I should probably set up a web store again, but I just haven't done it. Maybe once we get a purple store set up, maybe we can just... Uh, purple store store. Purple store store, baby. Ooh. Maybe we can have some Brett Sauter photography uh, link there. Make it easy for everybody. You know what else Two birds one stone. could possibly be coming about? You tell me. I don't know. I feel like uh, I feel like we've got a great group of people here. and People in the comments? People in the comments. People in this world. Talking just... Uh, Purple, purple folks in the and i feel like i don't just want to reach out on saturdays only oh I, i'd like a place gracious. to go to where we could just hang out as a group and uh communicate throughout well we have purple chats we have the purple messenger group which if you reach out to us we'd be happy to add you to it but uh i know what you're talking about right now is there so something else coming our way maybe soon there's something coming your way soon in the works and, uh we feel like it would be a great idea to get all the purple people in one centralized Facebook group group. What? So maybe purple tomorrow, group. maybe Monday, we're actually going to have a Facebook group that goes live. Purple gang gang group group on Facebook. That way you can share all of your purple customs, your purple toys, your 
your purple philosophy, anything that you want us to see wholeheartedly without us missing within the 10 minutes of show prep that we do before we go live, which is it's way too late. We will have a Facebook group that will be going live very, very soon. Um, our great friend, the Purple Robot Robot, is going to be spearheading all of this. Um, we'll find out more information. Check us out on Facebook at the, uh, the Purple Gang I don't know. Gang Facebook I mean, page. Yeah. We'll put more details down there. Purple Gang Gang Group, Group Curtis. It also heard, could buddy. be smoke and mirrors. We could be Purple making group. up everything we're saying this right now. This could be absolute nonsense. This we could be a know. fever dream. Fever dream. Fever dream. Fever dream. Fever That's dream. Not on here. I didn't it's not. That. I know. I, I just wanted to that. throw you under the bus because I know that there's a fever dream. That might be next week. We had yeah. a fever dream video that we were going to play, but it's got like some weird like Zelda reboot remix music, and I didn't want to get that. Was my favorite part straight. about it? Yes, Steph. It is way past my normal bedtime. We it kept is. them awake. It is, but you did this for us, and yeah. we appreciate that. I did. So excited, and you're going to be up probably for at least another hour after the show goes off. Probably because that purple haze haze. Purple fun fun baby. Yep. Purple grape fun babe. fun. Grape babe indeed. Hashtag purple grape babe. Hashtag purple grape babe. Wait, what? Who said that? I'm normally asleep by now too, but that's has to a lot. That yeah, depends upon the amount I've had to drink, which is not very much today. Brett's been with me the entire day. How much has Van had to drink today? One glass. Yeah. That wasn't even a big glass. Mm -mm. Bam, please take ball. please take your gun off of Brett. <laughs> Let him answer completely safe and sound. <laughs> That's not cool, buddy. Brett, if you're not safe, blink eight times. He didn't blink eight times, so mm -hmm. he is absolutely okay. <laughs> Logan, stop pointing that gun at our guests. <laughs> What's wrong with you, Logan? Go back to bed. Don't jump down eight stairs. Curtis isn't watching anymore. He totally did, actually, uh, he did. Curtis. Um, he lives for that. When he we were for that. When we were coming so upstairs Curtis from outside, so about to come up to the uh, the hoarder studio to start the show, you hear this loud, and it's Logan jumping down the entire set of stairs. He says, notice me, Senpai Curtis. Notice me. And he, he, like, he jumped down the stairs, broke both of his legs. Mm -hmm. He's still there right now. Yeah. He fell asleep, though. It might yeah. have been the pain. That's true. He nodded off. I figured lessons needed to be learned. He cried and screamed so loud for the longest time. Curtis, Senpai, why won't you save me? Did Curtis told him to jump. How many steps I jumped down. We're like, Logan, shut up, dude. We're about to go live. Yeah. <laughs> Curtis is he's in the green, green room right now, buddy. But, um, He's okay now. You see, the trick is don't jump down eight steps because that's impossible. That's not. What you have to realize is the steps don't even exist. Oh, I'm glad Logan's asleep right now. <laughs> I feel like that was deep. Yeah. I need a pair of boots. <laughs> right. Curtis Morpheus, like yeah. bend the spoon, like there is no spoon, right. like, like. Like the pencils, like the rubber pencils, like, oh, you see how the pencil, like, bro, like, that's just. Why did the seven year old jump out of the window? He just, he knows the right thing to do. Mm. Man, that was deep. That I'm was. never going to forget that line no. ever again. I'm never going to repeat that line. I'm going to get that tattooed to Logan on my ever. eyelids. You should. The inner or the outer? Can you elaborate on that, bread? Mm. Oh. Oh. You heard it here first. Hashtag nine stairs. Wait, it was seven a couple weeks ago. Now it's eight. Now it's nine. He's level or not. We'll count him when I throw you down. Yep. So we have uh, 8,342 people in the live stream currently, but only 7,000 of you have uh, entered the hashtag. Let me go and enter with my 7, 400 dummy accounts. Yeah. The tatted toy door. You have an opportunity to receive this deluxe dwarf legion builder you know, from. You get yourself one of these, and you get yourself the cavern dwarf too. You heat up there. You pluck his beard out. You pluck the one from the cavern dwarf. You stick that one in. And instantly, you have two different new dwarfs. 
New yeah. dwarfs. You, you heard, heard it, it first. first. Exactly. And you know, we don't want you breaking your action figures. You know, there's more than one way to heat up your action figures. Some people use a hot mug of water from the microwave. Other people use a heat gun. Some use a hair dryer. I personally throw every last toy in the bathtub and jump in afterwards. Do what's right for you and your toys. Toys are meant to be played with, not broken. Heat them first. Yes! Yes, that is correct. Splish, Splash, Jordan was taking a bath. Seven. With uh, toys. Duck floaties. Shout out Garfield and friends. He's not drowning. I'm okay. Absolutely. My chemical romance. I'm not okay. I liked up. And uh, we've got a giveaway to go right here. 43 entries in the tatted toy forge. For Let's this. give them uh, five more seconds. One Mississippi. Two Mississippi. I miss the Mississippis that we got down in Toylanta with Crooked Billy. Letter, letter, yeah. I, humpback, humpback, I. Snake, 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 snake. 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 Evil Stay. John. La, 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 local. Shout out to our home. John Toft. Evil Stick. Hit up the Purple Gang Gang uh, Facebook page and shoot them a message with your mailing address or Maybe I don't we know. Can, yeah. uh, eat some Bojangles and uh, we know what you did. But um, we'll absolutely get this dwarf to you. Shoot us a message, brother. We love you. It was super great to see and you. And by dwarf, we, we meant this open bag of tranches. Chips from us to you. They came from Japan. Enjoy them. Yeah, and uh, here's another. Ooh, we're gonna. No, I want to give them the other ones. Shrimp yeah. chips. I hope there's not another bag in there. But uh, you know, speaking of shrimp chips, you have roughly uh, 32 hours to enter the Dirks Custom Contest. 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 And you have a chance of winning. These chips, Valiant Knights, 3D printed parts, customs, a weekend vacation to Wait, Bernie. Bernie. Hashtag you won't die. It's no big deal. If you die, you die. I feel like these chips probably taste somewhat similar to Bernie's ass. I mean, they're bad. Well, he was drugged up and down in the seawater for Those a while. Exactly, a yeah. Dog. I hit on some, some truths there. Um Looking forward into next week, uh, do we have any idea who we'll be spending our, our next Saturday with? Any clue? Curtis. Curtis will be here. We love Curtis. Yep, we got Curtis us some Curtis. Curtis. So we might have a guest next week. We'll know after this episode ends. We kind of made a slide a few minutes before. Um, so take this with a grain of salt, you know. Um, but maybe we'll have a – We got a committal, non-committal from – uh, you know, let's see here. Let's see. What's his name? Is it, has he messaged you? Let's Hit that slide. Hit the slide. Right. Okay. Rope him in. So, then uh, check your messages. One oh. six shooter, uh, Trevor Williams. Maybe we're going to put a big maybe on here. That way you can't sue us if he doesn't show up next weekend. So uh, somebody yeah, will be here. I know at least three people that will be here. If you don't want to come, Trevor, that's completely cool. Yep. It's completely cool, you know. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Oh, see, Trevor's still in the eyeball. comments. That's why we threw maybe in there. <laughs> Was we that confirmation? It's completely cool. Trevor, uh, will we see you Saturday on the screen or in the comments? But if not, no big deal. Yeah. Whatever. We'll have We're fun friends either way. That. Yeah, we love you wholeheartedly. Absolutely. Made you, made you He's a busy up. man. He's often hard to pin down. It's true. You know, guys, um, the only thing I love more than spending time with Trevor is trevor getting to spend time with me oh so yeah oh wow curtis you that drive out there. To north carolina all right on my way all right we'll see you in six days buddy yep can't wait That'll soon be i mean yeah if you you can stay as long as you need to super great right and uh we've got lots of great prizes for you uh trevor um you know bars of gold um frankincense Myrrh. Prawn chips. Prawn chips. You know. And uh, bourbons. We mochi we, Kit Kats. Yeah. And by mochi coming Kit on Kats, PGG yes. Live, you actually get a three month uh non video um uh, what do we call this waiver? Mm -hmm. So you can say whatever you want. We won't clip it. So uh we'll see you next week. Otherwise, you'll be on the show next week, regardless, with a picture of you with one of those like moving mouth gifts. Trevor Puppet. Always, 
a Trevor puppet. So, Trevor, you'll be here one way or another next weekend. Hopefully, it's the real you. If not, we'll see either way. Uh, I do want to address uh, a comment. Um, we have actually put a a moratorium on. Yeah, we don't even talk about a dead it. horse. We don't even. Yeah, we don't yeah. even talk about the specifics of it. Yeah, we're, we're just we're, we're, the we're lifting group. people up. We're the one group that will defend you. We will attack people for you, Trevor. We will fight them. We will send Big Greg to their house, kick in their door. We hear one more comment about the stuff we don't want to hear about anymore. So you've got your ha back. ha ha wholesome. That's right. Shout out purple. Keep it purple, people. Gang, gang baby. Hey Curtis, what you got, buddy? Yes. It's not blackmail. It's not blackmail. What are you talking about? We can still do this regardless. Words are just words. Mm -hmm. But we love you. We're wholehearted. Absolutely. Like we are. We're excited. Yeah. We're excited about things that may possibly happen next week. Yeah. Speaking of which. Your... Absolutely. <laughs> Speaking of which. Uh, yeah. We'll have our people contact your people and those people will get together and they'll work some things out. No ditty. I just got a message from the Purple Drone Drones. We have Trevor's DNA. He will be on the show next weekend regardless. <laughs> Cuck -cuck -cuck clone <laughs> All right. You heard it here first. So thanks for tuning in. Oh, you know, thanks for tuning in. Hey, Brett, thanks, thanks for joining, for joining us. us. Hey, thanks for having me. Hey, Curtis, thanks for joining us. Trevor, we'll see you next weekend. Love you, peoples. Everybody you in the guys. chat, thank you. Bye, Bye. my lady.